basically. I'm sleeping, fuck y'all guys. Oh, we're back. Tennis court, volleyball court, something going on in there? We can't get in. Oh, it's a pool. Drown yourself. Check the door. Maybe we can go in there. What if we can go in every single one of those cabins? No, they probably all walk. I tried already. I don't think oh, you did? Way. Yeah. You already tried to go. Oh, they're waiting there's, in the golf cart. There's, there's a golf cart Emma's over there. waiting. Emma's waiting in the golf cart, but I would go to the right. Looks like there's some little statue. Oh, it's a plaque. Where? Right there. Oh, I see it. Today's menus. They'd probably go back behind the thing yeah, as well. Yeah, Caitlyn, I call. I don't think anyone knocked Caitlyn out of first place all summer. Caitlyn, the goat. Go back behind and do a 360 Roman. Go back that that way. This Something's way? definitely back behind. It looks blocked off. Yeah, well, you never know. They like to hide stuff back there. You never know. Maybe you can go through the gate. Her name is Caitlyn. Uh, this girl's name is Emma. Oh, so this girl's Caitlin name is Caitlin. Abigail. Talking with this one. Mm-hmm. The Asian was Caitlyn? This, this one. one was Caitlyn. Oh, okay. That the Caitlyn was like... Abigail was scene. dating... The... Ready to roll? No, Emma was dating the jock. Yeah. We have to make a decision if we're ready to go. That face I make when I'm in this uncertain. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> well, we can drive. Get ready for a quick time. Time to let loose and vamoose this caboose. How are you so dramatic? Annoying. Confident. Oh. It's just acting. It's what people want. So you're faking it? I mean, in a way, faking it is just being yourself, but louder. You should try it sometime. You sense. never know who you might impress. No. <laughs> it's too late now anyway. For what? You and Nick? You never know unless you put yourself out there. Because it loads okay, right so before a quick time. If I were to put myself out there, I bet they'll be a lot harder whenever dark. there's actually bad guys. Data. Yeah, exactly. probably be like ten right back to back to back, sweet. back to back to back quick times for like no, half a second to decide. Summer That's way. what they do. They make you make like split second decisions. For this shit, I wouldn't be. Yeah, sure. But well, you never know. If there's 103 outcomes. Probably like so many areas you haven't been to. You guys handle hit him up. Oh, I already have his email. It was in the packet they gave to us on the first day. Email? Are you 93? What's wrong with email? Cool. I'm really gonna miss you, Abby. It looks so real. Oh, hold up! Oh, Sometimes. but the lodge is that way. Go right here. Why? Come on, scenic route? One last victory lap around the camp? Ooh. Guys, we weren't supposed to go that way. <laughs> we want to take this Onward to death. Sure. What's the victory? I don't think we're gonna die. She, it's just, it's just I'm gonna dump her boy Dylan, bro. She can die. I kind of thought it was nice to be offline. Ugh, I didn't. Plus, my subs need me. My subs need me. <gasps> I don't think she's on. I don't think she's on YouTube. How could they live without you? That's why I feel like we need five people to break the tie. You know what I'm saying? Doesn't matter. Uh, doesn't they matter. Even get by for two months without no, you. Like, every God, time every it's time. 50 50, each has been you. Whatever you yeah, know, That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Very important. But if it wasn't 50 50, Damien, it would be like a right. hilarious video monologues. They rely on me. Oh, totally. You're a big deal. Uh, yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm sure they're gonna be like really happy or rock. 
<laughs> what did you say, Eagle? My favorite spot? The fire pit? The island. <sighs> Their mouths messed Not up a lot. Not right? It's kind of weird. Is, is that smoke? Should we tell someone? Mm, it looks pretty contained. It's probably just Mr. H burning some stuff before, you know, he closes camp for the summer. Yeah. But speaking of which, we should, we should probably, you know, get back. Oh yeah, worried Nick's, you know, gonna leave it at you. Well, no, they're probably like all waiting for us. Mm -hmm. Everyone's waiting for us. Everyone, yeah. Nick, waiting for you. All, everyone, same. Nobody's going anywhere. Jacob took the rotary, rotary arm, whatever it is. Okay. That was epic outro. Second intro too. <laughs> Don't worry, Jacob. I got you. I got a full tank of gas. So. That's pretty cool. Oh fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, idiot. <laughs> Does nobody own phone chargers anymore? Hey, there's no signal out here anyways, dude, okay? This place is like patchy as balls. <sighs> Your balls are patchy? What? No. Dylan's gay. Oh. It's okay, I'll just go get some juice yeah. from Mr. H before we go. And... Uh, you. <sighs> it's some juice from Mr. H, right? Why do you say it like that? Hey, Nick. Okay. Hey, Definitely. where were you guys? Wouldn't you like to know? Ignore her, please. Let's go. <laughs> Just gotta get these looking. bags up onto the. Oh, hey, hey, here. Let me um, let me get it for you. I can take care of my own bag, thank you. What? Are you sure? Because I mean, it's really not that big. She of a can deal. take care of her own bag, thank you. We can both oh, take care of people. our own bag, thank you. Hey, that's an eye. I want cool. them both to die now. Ah, <laughs> oh, so heavy. He's making bets. He's gonna survive the last. Who are we nudging? We nudging. ain't nudging. Uh, uh, Abby, do you need? Yeah. yeah. Can I? That was a good nudge right there. That was a good nudge. Good nudge. Thank you. <laughs> good nudge. Thought she could carry her own bag. Dylan's <laughs> making plays. There's Dylan out there. Dylan's making plays. <laughs> Dylan came in clutch. There's hey, three girls and four Ryan? boys. Oh yeah, he's probably off being all brooding and mysterious and luring somewhere. <laughs> I'm here. What were you doing the under podcast. there? Having a little me party? Uh, I was listening to a podcast, uh, actually. I was listening oh. to a podcast. Podcast, actually. nice, that's cool. What's it about? Damn. We're playing as Dylan, though. Is it about me? Is it about me? Well, we do not support gay. We're supposed to be friendly, <laughs> though, not mind your own business. Yeah, what's it about? Is it about me? You think I was listening to a podcast about you? <laughs> okay, if anyone had a podcast about them. Nice one, guys. Yeah, if there was a podcast called How to Look and Smell. What is that guy's you? problem? Holy cow. Oh my god, you are so childish. It's, uh, yeah, look right. and smell Does like Does everybody that? know where the bathroom is? No, it's a, it's a paranormal podcast. This episode was actually about this place. Really. <laughs> look at his eyes. The Hack of Hackett's Quarry. The who of the what's Shit. it where now? What's the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? You don't know about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Uh, if I did, would I be asking them ass? Tell her about the Hag of Hackett's Quarry. I don't think she wants to know about the Hag of Hackett's oh, Quarry. Can we just please stop saying the Hag of Hackett's Quarry? It's just this campfire story for the kids. It's, um, there's supposedly an old woman who died in a fire a few years back. She haunts the woods looking for her lost baby boy. There are like reports of whispers or whatever, and then this figure that floats around, you know, textbook ghost stuff. Some people say that if she catches you alone, she'll try to turn you into her son. Or kill you, okay. or something. Ah. Know, it's not really clear. Anyways, Haggah Haggah's Corey. You made that up. It's 
right here in the podcast, man. Cool story, bro. Seriously, though, you should have seen the first time he told the story to the kids at the campfire. They were scarred for life. I mean, not for life. <laughs> you gotta be careful with this stuff, man. This shit's true. Come on, dude, bullshit. What's the holdup, Hacketeers? Uh, yeah, uh, nearly done, Mr. H. Well, hop to it. Get those butts in gear. <laughs> Sorry, Mr. H. You had to liberate some luggage. Shut up. Maybe if somebody didn't spend so much time trying to press the ladies' ball as ghost stories. You asked. Ghost stories? The Hag of Hackett's Quarry. Oh! <sighs> hey, you still have the van key, Mr. H? Well, yes, I do. But you know, I'd lose my head if it wasn't stuck on. Back to the office I go. Give me a hand, would you, Ryan? Oh, okay. Yo, Mr. H. What's up, DJ Dylan? Any chance I could get a little charge? I want to have some uh, tunes for the road. No can do. <laughs> oh, well, it doesn't matter what I choose now, does it? Yeah, it doesn't. Come on, that's like super unchill. Hey, dude, man. I'm like the chillest flippin' bro in the whole world, man. I just need some tunes for the ride, man. <laughs> all right, that's enough. Five minutes? Like, like five minutes, that's all I need, man. You said no, Dylan. Okay, yeah, I know, but I was just... Let me meet you at the van, okay? You guys made Ryan lose his patience. Uh, so, uh, Chris, I I'm actually glad we got a moment to talk. Uh, uh-oh. I'm not fired, am I? <laughs> no, no, no. It's, um, it's just, you know, about the whole thing w with the... Hold that thought, partner. I'm gonna have to take this. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, sorry. Hello. <laughs> Y'all snoopers, bro. Leave the intel. They're almost out of here, all right? We don't want to have Just hold your damn horses, all right? Everything's a okay on this end. Bobby and I are geared up. If he's in the area, we'll get him. This is a waste of time. You know what? You know what? Just hold your horses, all right? No, should I have? He's gone quiet. Probably staying out of the way. Speaking of which, the longer you keep me on this damn phone, the longer it's gonna take me to get rid of these damn kids. Yeah, of course. Adios. Get out of there. Oh my god. Sorry, I, I wasn't... I wasn't listening. I, I was yeah. just like, waiting. Like, I mean, I heard... That's what uh, happens when I you mean, eavesdrop. I you were. We're cool, champ. Just come on in. Sorry I pushed you out like that. Well, it's bro's fault for not being above 10 IQ. Your footsteps going through the doors if you just eavesdrop, you just sit there. Looking for the keys? Uh, no, end of summer, busy, busy. You know. Anyway, you were asking me? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, it was just the whole. Hold up, here, I'll be right back. I'm gonna stay on the headset though, I just right. have to go. You, you know, whether or not I should, like, leave my sister with my grandparents, since I'd have to live on campus, you know. My mom's not exactly around, so I wouldn't want to leave Sarah on her own. You know, fam our family's. Small enough as it is. Well, family is important. Right? Dang it! Wait, what are the choices? 
is everything okay? This is important to me. Which one is what? Frustrated no, is this is important to me, concerned is everything okay? Yeah, but what direction? I'm not looking at my screen. Which one do I go left? Yeah. Yeah, just go left. Did it work? Is everything okay? <coughs> you got a hot day tonight? Oh boy. If you only knew. Rip, Mr. Hackett. So, uh, <laughs> what, what did you need me for? You're one of my favorite counselors, Ryan. You know that. Get the dinner. hell out of here! <laughs> but. You know how many calls I get from parents? Letter after letter with these terrified kids that they send out. Hmm. I, I didn't realize that. Believe it or not, scaring kids away from sleepaway camp is kind of bad for business. So maybe just ease up on the ghost stories? No way! <laughs> we, gotta, we gotta keep our job, guys, for next summer. No way you guys actually said that. Oh my... He's gonna get mad, bro. Y'all are actually so stupid. It was just a fun story that weirdo kid told me last month. Hey, there's no weirdo here. At Hackett's Quarry, everyone's their own brand of cool. You cancelers gotta be the responsible ones. Keep the kids happy. Keep the kids safe. So knock it off. Yeah, of course. I mean... We are. Denny's cars. Seriously, Chris, what's going on? I just want to get you guys safely out of Dodge before the sun goes down. <laughs> what? I don't care. I was questioning. I haven't hacked an absolute. Totally. Yeah. Best to get you all out of harm's way. Oh. Woods are chock full of live game and local hunters hop to it the second camp's over. It's not safe. Mmm. Where in the good goddamn are they? Will you say goodbye to Caleb and Kaylee for me? He sort of just snuck off. Well, you'll see him again next year. Caleb works at the scrapyard during the off season, and Kaylee, well, she's still figuring out what she wants to do. She's got her whole life ahead of her. They both just come and go as they please, really. Teenagers, am I right? I actually could have used the help packing up since we were short staffed. Hey, you guys seem to manage all right. But I'll tell them both you were sad you missed them. Unlocked the van, put the keys in my pocket, came in the office. Right where I left him. Uh -huh. Howdy. Let's get out of here. Right in the coffee mug. Look at them got cargo pants. <laughs> he got that shit on though. <laughs> We ain't going nowhere Make before sure they're all ready to go. For real this time. Oh yeah, he's gonna be pissed that this car's not started. <laughs> are we... Are we <laughs> telling the truth? Get your phone back before the rest of us. I never turned it in. You sure did turn it off before you handed it in, Dylan. Them's the rules, you noob. <laughs> noob. Yeah, noob. I try not to dwell on the past, man. Good. Cause it's time to dwell on the minivan. Get on with our respective lives. Move it, let's go. He's about to lose it. Mm. What's the problem? <laughs> oh, really, I don't know. I, I think there's something wrong with the engine, Mr. H. Yeah, I can see that. He's no problem. Yeah, pose, dude, though. it's just, just like take a look in the head. A put. All right, let me try. <laughs> What? Oh, yes. I'm telling you. All right, Somebody else tried it. Well, maybe you're doing it wrong. Maybe you're doing it wrong. What the fuck, dude? Enough! Enough, both of you. 
Shit. Come on. Right, dude, come on. Chill. Chill, Let's go. dude. Oh. Damn it. I thought I told you kids to check everything. No, we did. It, it should be working. Yeah, well, coulda and shoulda doesn't mean it is, does it? Damn it! She's no. It's pretty obvious. Okay. Oh, uh, okay. Well, uh, look, it's not that big of a deal, okay? We'll just spend one more night here. No! No! Just uh. stop. Let me think. Damn it. You're right. You're right. Yeah. What? Yeah, you're right. That one was moving. We got an upgrade. Oh. <laughs> Run. Come here for a sec. Uh oh. Get the hell out of here. Make sure that everybody is inside the lodge for tonight. Lock the doors. No one in, no one out. No one. Got it? Okay. I'll be back first thing in the morning. All right, peace out. And we'll get you all on the road. You just have to keep everyone inside. Can you promise me you'll do that? Damien. Yeah. Sure. We'll, we'll stay inside. And a boy. First thing, as soon as the sun goes down. Lock the doors. <laughs> and for God's sake, keep the noise down. Oh my God, he's like, I'm out of here, bro. You <laughs> want <laughs> smoke? He knows the hag of Hackett Creek is coming, bro. <laughs> Quarry. Not so... Creek. What was that about? He, uh, said to stay inside. That we're not leaving until the morning. Are you kidding me? Um... Are you kidding me? What are we supposed to do? Well, we should go inside, like he said. We could go inside. Until morning. Yeah. Or... Or, we could do something else. Uh, what are you talking about? No Mr. Hackett, no screaming kids. Just a bunch of grown ass adults ready to cut loose and get down with their animal side. Oh, oh. hell yeah! P A R T. Why the fuck not? Alright, it seems like the stars have aligned for us, no? Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> One so last weird. epic bonfire <laughs> blowout for all time. <laughs> That's <dead> around. <laughs> <laughs> no alcohol. Oh, dude. <laughs> Fuck yes. I'm in, Nick. You're in. Wait, what does yeah, he have? Dylan's in, obviously. My man, Caitlin. I'm saying, sir. I go with my Oh, I thought you lifted it. Yeah, up or okay. Em. What do you say? Mm. <laughs> yeah, I'm in. Mr. Hackett seemed pretty insistent we stay in the lodge. He was just trying to freak us out. You know? Like, um. Right, the media. Find stupid ghost stories. Why would he want to scare us? I don't think he was trying to freak us out, Jacob. I think he was really freaked out by something. Jesus Christ. Chris seemed real serious about this, guys. Just say you're in, man. Come on, one last night. Yeah, dude, he won't oh even God. know. I promised. No, 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 dude, dude. It's all good. All right, we get it. Oh, you know, they're getting bored of Ryan. You don't want to disappoint uh. Danny. I don't even know what to say. It doesn't matter what you say now, because it's going to be them. Whatever, man. It's gonna be fine, man. Trust me. It's gonna be chill. 
All right, all right, all right. Hacketeers, party planning committee. Let's do this. Um, okay. First things first. Nick and Abby, you will get some firewood. Uh, M and I will so go to stores for some supplies. And uh, Dylan, you just yeah, we're planning for a party. Charge the phones for something. Yeah. Uh, all right, music. let's do this. this could Yay! Happen. Chapter two. Slaughter at the campfire. <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> that is about to get That's popped. That's a sniper. That's me in Call of Duty. <laughs> oh, someone might get their head sniped off right now. Right now. Oh. Oh, oh yeah. Oh. Oh fuck. He's already what bloodied the hell? up. It's hunting season, boys. Hunt <laughs> season. Average Oklahoman. <laughs> oh. Average Oklahoman, man. That blood. <laughs> What's the sign <laughs> saying? <laughs> Hunt <Hunting> season. <laughs> Let's go have a campfire with a sniper. He's definitely gonna take someone out. Please <laughs> hunt people. I oh, guess. here we go. No, this is the lady. We didn't even oh, find. A, we didn't even find anything. Come back to me. Yeah, we definitely didn't find anything, guys. Let's see what you found. Nothing. Empty-handed. You need to look around you, find my cards, and I can help you. Where I'm from, we look out for each other. Find them, yeah, dude, please. Fuck, Roman. You gotta help me out. <laughs> the crow, bro. You better be going. It's still early and the moon is bright, but time won't wait. The map looks huge. Not I didn't want to for those with a story to tell. It's been, we've been like two hours looking for look cards. Look out for yourselves. <laughs> look out for my cards. Okay, we'll get the card next time. <laughs> Sorry, to... old lady. 100% of the pack. Stole the motor arm. Open this cabin. Make sure you get back. One of these ghosts and bags in the cabin. Oh, I'll be back. Were those like all the crucial decisions? I think so. Most likely. Who would ever leave the, their bags in the cabin? Like, that's not doing anything. <laughs> what? Like, the story is gonna be like. Why the hell do you not have the bags? I guess Damien's gone. Ooh. One second, I'll be back. I'll just leave it on Emina. Oh, are we playing as Emina? 